care. Let me touch. What, is he your shadow now, Vic? That's good. Don't get smart with me. Dude, gonna have to wash your mouth out with soap. What do you want, Vic? Mr. Brown's monthly cut of his drug sales? Sure, no problem. And a couple of your best girls, maybe? It's a joke, dude. Relax. We're just having a little fun, okay? Where's your sense of humor? <laughs> a little too early, I guess. I'll get that package right away. Hello. Out to lunch. That guy's a lox. He's dumber than spit. Dumber than dirt. Dumber than a honest job. <laughs> the old days, huh? I mean, a couple of dumb kids who didn't have a clue. Yeah, but when things got tough, we knew who to depend on. That's right. Old Butch and Sundance were pretty tight, huh? We were. Uh-oh. Just keep your hands where I can see them, and we're going to have a little talk about my sense of humor. Looks like Mr. Dugan here is making a career move. Hey, you got it. When Mr. Brown gets back, he's going to find out there's been a few changes made. And you're first. Uh, Amos, um... You're gonna be running the business, you're gonna be needing merchandise, right? Maybe we could, you know, talk a deal Joe, or something. You're no good trader. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Prado. I am gonna be needing some merchandise. This is some good friend you got here, Vic. <laughs> That'll work. You okay, bro? I'm sure glad you know all that karate stuff. Look out, Joy! Come on, let's go. Oh, you won. You would have got me. I don't want to let you down, Walker, but Vic saved my life today, and I'm going to pay him back by sending him to prison? Joy. You can't let yourself get emotionally tied up about this. Vic's a criminal, and it's our job to take him down. I just don't know if I can. OK. If you want to quit the assignment, then I strongly suggest that you turn in your badge. You can't walk the fence, Joey. You got to be strong, just like you had to be when Gino was killed. Gino! Gino! I get my hands on who killed him, I swear. You let me worry about that, Joy. You've got to concentrate on the fight. I don't even care. Now that he's gone, it doesn't even matter. Gino wouldn't want to hear that. He wouldn't want you to give up. Now that he's gone, who's going to train me? I will. What is it, Joy? You're not concentrating. I keep seeing Gino dead there, lying on the floor. Look, Joy. Gino's death was a terrible tragedy. But Gino would be the first one to tell you that you've got to focus on the future, not the past. Now, if you're going to lose this fight because your heart's not in it, then all of Gino's training has gone for naught. Are you going to let that happen? No. Well, good. Let's get to it then. Come on, now. sir. All right. Go. That's it. There you go. For you, Gino. Brown's coming back in town tomorrow. He's going straight to the meet. I'll be there to sell him the merchandise. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Thanks for straightening me out. Again.
he's gonna see When you're in Texas, look behind you Cause that's where the Rangers gonna be